So I am late on this, my bad for that, but there was a Spider-Man hot toy revealed for Marvel Spider-Man 2, or another one I should say anyway, because you know, we went over the first two for Miles in uh, Peter's advanced suit, but this new one, it's actually going to be for the symbiote suit for Insomniac, but as well, we have some other details to discuss regarding the symbiote in today's video, and some theories to talk about, and some theories to debunk as well, so let's get into that. So we're actually going to be on my computer, and I figured this would probably make this a little easier, I could just, you know, show you everything right here, and just highlight whatever all that good stuff so uh yeah this is the hot toy for the symbiote suit i'd say this looks pretty cool besides like the suit itself looking like armor i still don't fuck with that personally but you know it is what it is fuck it i don't know i guess this also means that they're committing to this design which you know it, it, it is what it is fuck it as long as we have like you know a bunch of other symbiote suits i'll be all right if anything I'll, I'll use like the regular classic symbiote suit or some shit actually yeah speaking of which i hope they actually reveal their um their their classic symbiote suit like how they had like you know just their regular red and blue classic suit in the first game I wonder what that's gonna look like that would be really cool to see down the road eventually but with that there's some interesting things to talk about with this hot toy so yeah let's get into it let's get into the details as far as you know like what comes with it stuff like that then we can talk about the theories and other details about just the suit itself not really regarding the hot toy so it says here it's about approximately 30 centimeters tall it has a uh, 30 points of articulation so that's cool it also comes with web wings as you can see so yeah it comes with the symbiote suit web wings that's pretty dope i think and as well it has like some magnetic function comes with a uh, black webbing and as well it comes with tendrils like this that shit looks pretty sick actually i can't even lie and lastly if you did not know or didn't notice it comes with pincers or aka the spider legs on the advanced suit so with that being said this seemingly deconfirms a popular theory people had when the teaser trailer for the game released that theory being that peter in the beginning of the game probably didn't have the spider legs got the symbiote suit you know used the tendrils from the symbiote got used to it then got rid of the symbiote and you know was not being able to use the tendrils anymore so he created the spider legs but that's likely not the case since the spider legs do have the symbiote attached to them or you know are like surrounding them and it's not it's, it's not like fully encasing them either like peter himself it's just like kind of around them because likely you know the symbiote can't control the legs because you know they're mechanical but you know since the legs are likely similar to doc ox the symbiote can probably control them through peter's mind of the neural link to the spider legs so that's interesting seemingly we may have these mechanical legs at the beginning of the game but who knows we'll see i guess and uh before we move on there is is a special edition which i kind of find interesting so let's go over that and uh this is kind of cool so as you can see it's basically the same thing but it just comes with like the symbiote peeling back off of the advanced suit or peeling forward onto the advanced suit so that's pretty dope can't lie so with that let's transition to the story trailer and talk about some details of the symbiote i haven't talked about yet fully in a video so i wanted to talk about the symbiote and some aspects in the story trailer of it and i wanted to go over this scene because the eyes of the symbiote suit and as well the legs seem to be different it's kind of hard to see when zooming in close but the legs are definitely not straight and the eyes towards the nose area definitely don't seem to be a clean curved line it looks more like how we we see it at the end of the gameplay reveal like here so i find that to be interesting this seemingly confirms that the symbiote will be evolving throughout the story similarly to like spectacular spider-man symbiote in that show how you know that evolved throughout time and you know it had three different designs so i'm excited to see that and as well brian Intahar did do an interview recently where he did say that there's more to the symbiote than they have shown us so far so this likely seems to be the case and you know can't wait to see what they have in store for us with the symbiote with you know different designs or whatever and it evolving over time throughout the story of marvel spider-man 2 also one more thing i wanted to highlight in the scene of mary jane running from peter is that since the symbiote is likely evolving it's taking more control of him over time so i do wonder how far the symbiote has gotten to peter like is he sleeping and the symbiote is using his body as a joyride essentially because that is an aspect in the comics the symbiote did take peter's body for like joyrides pretty much at night so you know do the usual fight crime kiss black cat here and there type shit but then he would wake up next morning and feel sore bruised etc and he would be so tired and not really know why little did he know the symbiote was you know again taking his body at nighttime while he was sleeping for joy rides 
and fighting crime and shit. This aspect of the symbiote did carry over into the animated series of the 90s and as well as Spider-Man 3 sort of, even though Spider-Man 3 was just the 90s animated series adapted into a movie. But as well, this did carry over into Spectacular Spider-Man with symbiote Spider-Man battling the Sinister Six while, you know, Peter himself was just sleeping the whole time while the symbiote completely took over. So that's interesting. I wonder if they will have that aspect of the symbiote in the game. I think that would be really cool to see. With that, what do you think of the symbiote hot toy and as well, you know, whether or not we may see the symbiote evolve into a different design over time like Spectacular Spider-Man and whether or not we will have the aspect of the symbiote where it takes over him during nighttime while he's sleeping. Make sure to comment your opinion down below so I can discuss all of that with you in the comment section. Thank you for taking time out of your day to click on this video. If you are new to the channel, I try my best to cover Spider-Man related scoops, rumors, leaks, confirmations for the games, movies, TV shows, and I try to upload as much as I can. So if any of that interests you, hit the subscribe button. We're on the road to 4,000 subscribers. If you want more of this type of content, leave a like on the video. Don't forget to check out my latest video on the left if you haven't already. I hope you ever had a good day and that you enjoyed the video. Until next time.